And our final report on Haiti's reconstruction four years after the quake, a success story from the catastrophe. A Haitian-based company that makes these tablets right here that rival the iPad mini. And it's three words on the back of them, made in Haiti, that's sending a message to the rest of the world. Okay. That's it. That's it. That's it. Robert LaBruce is picking up his new tablets to send to his friends in the U.S. Okay. I want to give them away because I'm so proud to have something like that made in Haiti. What these Haitian workers are doing at this company is something we are used to seeing in other places. But the meticulous work of making tablets is happening in Port-au-Prince for a company called Sertan. To be honest with you, the first time we discuss this with people, the first reaction is always for persons to laugh at the idea. It's just because people don't think it's possible. This is the birth certificate of the new Haiti that we all want to live in. Farrah Tylus, who nearly died in the quake four years ago, says this all seems like one big dream. Is it really me? It's like, wow, why me? But, you know, things happen. I am lucky, very, very lucky. Sertab hired 20 Haitian workers last year, trained them, and opened for business in October. Critical steps are taken to avoid contaminating tablet parts. So every worker has to put this on. And then workers take a 10-second air shower before going into the production room. Every tablet is carefully inspected. Every feature on these tablets is put through a stress test. Each worker is very aware of the perception, pressure, and pride of these three words on the back of the tablet, made in Haiti. Made in Haiti to us is a responsibility because we understand that this is just a new, new page that's opening in the economic history of this country. And we're proud of ourselves. Yeah, we are very proud. This is the beginning, just the beginning. Haiti is going to get out of it. Haiti is going to be big. Haiti is going to be big, he says. Where well, Sertab plans to double its workforce by the end of the year, and already the tablet is changing how ministries of government communicate in Haiti. Their next goal, putting tablets in the hands of students, transforming Haiti's education system. That woman was magical. I mean, she's yes. so, so happy to have a job. So happy to have a job, and so happy about the fact that those three words, made in Haiti, means so much to everybody on that production line, they were truly happy to be doing what they were doing. And these are high tech. This is even a phone as well? It uh, serves as a phone if you put your SIM card into it as well, so it hooks up with whatever network that you're with. And let me tell you, this phone really will transform the education system in Haiti because they're oh, going to try yeah. to sell these for $60. Amazing. It is. Great to see.